como esta es mi llamo Suzy. Mi llamo Maxime. ¿De dónde eres? Yo soy franco canadiense de Montreal. Yo soy de Londres. Welcome to our channel. Today we are reacting to Jorge Negrete and Pedro Infante. Yeah. Jorge Negrete is a famous Mexican singer and actor, and Pedro Infante also actor slash singer, and they were always performing in the film that they were playing and uh -huh. playing the song in the movie in black and white because they used to be popular in the like the 40s, the 50s, the 60s. And the song today it's from a movie. It's a movie called Two Careful Fellows, Dos Tipos de Cuidado. It's a movie that they both performed in in 1953 with music by Manuel Esperon. The lyrics here, I will read the plot of the movie because it's quite interesting what's going on right in the movie. The song is a scene from the movie. This is a fight between the two men that used to be friends. They dated each other relative. Each dated the family of the other person. <laughs> Pedro Malo was dating Jorge Bueno's sister. And Jorge was dating Pedro's cousin. Suddenly, Pedro disappeared to marry his own cousin. A year later, Jorge is recently engaged. And find out that Pedro is back, married with a newborn baby. And flirting with his sister again. <laughs> the scene takes place at the engagement party where Pedro appear uninvited. One last thing that is quite important is that if you look at the their name, right? Pedro Malo. Malo in Spanish means bad. Mm -hmm. there, his last name means bad. And then Jorge Bueno. Bueno means fine, good. So you can see one character is viewed as like more positive and the other is viewed as more negative. So apparently the song is, is full of inside joke and I don't think we'll be able to understand if we have not seen uh, the movie, but we're gonna try our best given yeah. what we just read about it. Yeah, we also have Instagram and our other two channels, don't forget to go check it out. And also Streamlab link in the description. Yes, for a small donation, we can do one of your suggestions. Yes. You should also subscribe if you like our doggy. It's in every reaction. We have more doggies sleeping around us, by the way, <laughs> behind us on the side. If you like dogs, they are in every other reaction. Yeah. Or if you want to suggest us more Mexican oh. um, singer to react to or anything from Latin America, even Spain. Yeah. Or non music also. Okay. So, okay, let's, let's get, get started. Que bueno, que me ha hecho el honor de bueno. solicitar su mano. Y de paso les diré que el hecho me congratula en alto grado, porque sin agraviar a los presentes, no podría encontrar un yerno mejor. If you don't know, that's Yogi Negrete in the movie called Yogi Bueno. Yogi mm. Good. Yes, it's the engagement party. <laughs> ¿Cuándo, mi amigo? Échale una flor a la feliz pareja. Uh, si ya se la tenía preparada. ¡Pedro! ¿Listo, muchachos? Usted dice cuándo. Arránquese. La gente dice sincera. Cada que se hace un casorio. Que el novio siempre la quiera, sino que le hagan velorio. Para esta novia no hay pena, pues va a tener buen marido. Porque bueno es cosa buena, por lo menos de apellido. Porque bueno es muy bueno, hijo de bueno también. Y su abuelo, ay qué bueno, quien se llamara como él. <risa> He's such a funny uh, performer and yeah. such a good actor. Every time that he performs, he's so good. Yeah, it's like <laughs> it's like everything he's gonna take, it's like um, his life, you know. Yes, yeah. amazing. Yeah, well, it looks really nice. <laughs> he makes fun of me. Échenle, pero más arriba. Procuraré ser tan bueno como dice mi apellido. Que se trague su veneno, el que Velorio ha pedido. Pedro es malo de apellido, retacharé su cuarteta. Él no más es presumido, porque no es malo, es maleta. Pedro malo, malo es... It's a statue. Oh, it's a statue. Okay, yeah. okay. Oh, but it's funny that that picture like this. Lo es the... Maleta. Pedro Malo. Es muy malo. Pedro Malo. Ma 
malo por obligación. Pedro Bach. Mi abuelo, uy, qué malo, hay que comprarle su lío. Ay, <risa> En una mañana de oro, alguien nubló todo el paisaje. Eran un cuervo y un loro, arrancándose el plumaje. Uh, that, damn, the, the stare down, I mean, the acting. What surprised me, the voice, the bass voice surprised me, like it's really good, but the acting is Oscar Wortley performance. I don't know how many awards those two win, but... Their acting performance to me is the detail, even in the finger, even in the way that he moves his, uh, his uh, nose, everything, it feels like it's so precise. True. It's unbelievably be believable. Yeah. <laughs> and the way like they, they're standing and talk to each other like that, you know, it's really, really unique. I really love it. It's like they're going to throw something to each other. <laughs> the quality of the acting gives me goosebumps. Hay que olvidar lo pasado si la culpable es la suerte. Que bueno y malo mezclado en regular se convierte. Yo soy malo, no lo niego, pero quisiera mezclar malo y bueno por si sale algo que sea regular. Todo bueno y seco. Por Dios, esos muchachos van a pelear. Y harto la grande carroña un colmenar visitaba para ver si la ponzoña con la miel se le quitaba como no se da lo bueno para placer del malvado con la miel y su veneno hoy anda el pobre purgado que lo entienda quien lo entienda, si es que lo sabe entender, y si acaso no lo entiende, hay que obligarlo a entender. Voy a decirle a la orquesta que toque. ¿Por qué? ¿Por qué? Te consta que no soy tonto, como tú lo has ¿Tú? presumido. Yo. Tonto no siento metido por el hambre. De amistades, el hambre siempre la calvo con el manjar del amigo. Mendigo es si no mendigo el que roba a sus amigos. Tú lo dices, lo sostengo, no te vayas a cansar, no le saques, si le saco, o se acabó este cantar. Oh my oh. god. This is so good. I wish that I, I understood Spanish better. Okay. Oh, okay. You wanna come? I don't know. Because we read we read the lyric before the performance, right? But I read that if you have not seen the movie and if you don't not familiar with the culture. It, there's, it's full of inside joke that you need yeah. to be familiar with the movie and the culture to understand. So I give up the lyrics. I tried to read the lyrics. I did not understand enough the context, but they're making fun of each other. You can tell by the, the, their face when they are making fun. Yeah. They, they are really playing the character. The acting is unbelievable. Those old black and white movie from Mexico, the acting is the best. I have ever seen. Actually, all over the world, I feel like old movie, like Alfred Hitchcock, old Alfred Hitchcock movie, and during that era, I feel like the actor was at the top to me because it was about the actor and not about the, the visuals. It was more about the story and how the actor portrays a story. Yeah. Versus now, it's more about like a they, fr frame per second, uh, how quick it can be on the screen, you know. And they so. use a lot of things to help the, the, the actor. And yeah. 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 And the back actor. then, it was. Uh, it was you naked almost like in a way in front of a camera yeah. and you need to perform and to me this is top class really acting. Good. This is like theater acting to me. Theater. True. <laughs> the way they talk and, um, and sing to each other is really believable, you know. And uh, when it's funny, it's funny. When it's, when it's like uh, sad a little bit, it's also sad, you know. When, I mean, if, if you are like uh, watching at them at those times, I feel like you're gonna think it's a like, real story. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for the amazing suggestion. 
please suggest us more and consider subscribing. Yeah. And see you very soon. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.